Welcome to The Daily Writer, where we share a lesson each day to help you cultivate the habits for writing success. Have you ever seen somebody make pottery? It's actually pretty fascinating. It's fun to watch them work, and it's often breathtaking to see the beautiful pots, vases, bowls, and other works of art they create with their bare hands. But what comes before the beautiful finished product? Well, you guessed it. What comes before that is putting a messy lump of clay on the table and getting their hands dirty. The clay is not formed. It's just a plain old unformed lump of clay. But the potter shapes it into something useful, beautiful, and eye-catching. Well, I think the same thing is true for us as writers. We've got to put clay on the table. We've got to start with a messy draft of whatever it is that we're writing. If we don't, then we won't have anything to work with. So my encouragement to you is to get that draft done as fast as possible so you can start working on it, so you can start revising, editing, and refining it. Remember, the mess always comes before the finished product. Don't be afraid to get messy. The messy potter's wheel is where all good writing begins. Here's your daily question. Are you willing to get messy with your first draft? And do you think perfectionism sometimes prevents us from moving ahead with our writing? Thanks so much for listening to today's episode. I want to take a moment to let you know about our daily writer membership community. You know, one of the very best ways to develop better habits and impact more people's lives with your writing is to spend time around other successful writers. So if you're tired of feeling isolated and chasing success on your own, then I know you're going to love the daily writer community. For years, I searched for the kind of writing community that I would want to join, but I could never find what I wanted. So I created my own. Some of the features include weekly writing sprints, monthly community calls, book discussions, calls with guest experts, and much more. For more info, you can visit dailywriterlife.com community. Thanks, and I'll see you tomorrow.